Hello everyone. This is COADB.com or the Coat of Arms database. And today we are briefly going to discuss several different coats of arms in the Benson family. The first is blazoned, argent, a quatrefoil between two trefoils slipped in ben sable between double cotices gules. Crest a bear's head and this was the coat of arms of Edward White Benson, born 1829, the Bishop of Canterbury, and I'm sorry, the Archbishop of Canterbury and the Bishop of Truro. Next, Argent three trefoils slip between two Bendlitz gules. This is recorded as being from Salisbury, County Wiltshire, England. Wasn't able to necessarily find this one, but possibly belonged to the family of Robert Benson, born 1797, a barrister and recorder of Salisbury, the son of Reverend Edmund Benson, priest vicar of Salisbury Cathedral. Next is the same coat of arms um, with a crest, a bear's head, erased argent, muzzle gules. Supporters to Bears Argent. This was the arms of Robert Benson, Esquire, born around 16, the year 1676 of Red Hall near Wakefield and Bramham Hall. He was a member of parliament for the city of York, a director of the South Sea Company, a member of the Privy Council, and a chancellor of the Exchequer. And he was created Baron Bingley in 1713. I believe it, the baronet, the, it expired after he died. I believe he only had a daughter. Next, I'm not going to read this rather long blazon, but this was the coat of arms and crest granted to Thomas Starling Benson, Esquire, born 1775 of North Cray Place in County Kent, England, described as a merchant and industrialist. And here we see his likeness. Next, Argent on a chevron between three goats passant sable as many escalop shells of the first. Crest, a Talbot's head erased Argent, crowned with a ducal coronet or. And I wasn't able to find out too much about this one, but we do know that this arms was born by Henry Benson Esquire, who died in 1725, gentleman of the Privy Chamber to King Charles II, and High Sheriff of County Northampton, son of Richard, and he purchased the Manor of Dodford in the year 1678. Here we see the Tomb of Henry Benson. Next is Argent on a chevron sable, three crosses for me or crest, the sun surrounded by a rainbow, each end issuing out of clouds all proper. We know that the crest, this crest here, was born by the Bensons of North Kelsey, who descended from Clement Benson who died in 1588, the son of Richard Benson of this same location. Next, a quarterly coat of arms with a crest, a bear's head, erased, argent, and muzzled. This was the arms of the John Benson, died 1563, Lord of the Manor of Bays Brown and Elterwater in County Lancashire. And he had a, a descendant named John Benson, born 1572, who had residences in both Bays Brown and Hawkshead, Lancashire. I also have it written down here that it was granted to Robert Benson of Lodge Lane in Liverpool and of Stag End in Hawkshead in 1880. Next, Azure, a chevron between six sinkyfoils or Crest, a bear's head coop proper, muzzled and collared with a chaplet of sinkyfoils or. This coat of arms and crest was granted in 1714 to William Benson, a gentleman of the city of Dublin, Ireland, 
son and heir of Thomas Benson of Dovenby County, Cumberland. Sable on a chevron in vect plane, cotized or three pallets of the first, each charged with the cross pate of the last, and a bear's head muzzled as a crest. This was granted in the 19th century to Colonel Robson Benson Esquire of Perrymead Court in County Somerset, the son of Thomas of the same location, and Thomas also had land or estates in Chigwell County, Essex. Next is Argent, a frigate shape, a frigate or ship in full sail, the Union ensign flying all proper on a chief wavy azure, a military officer's dexter hand proper, coop below the cuff or the coat gules, holding a sword erect of the first. And then it has the scales of justice and pineapples and a horse in the crest. Now, this was the coat of arms of Moses Benson, Esquire, born 1738, a British West Indies merchant who became heavily engaged in the Liverpool slave trade, the son of John Benson, born 1648, a salt dealer of man rigs near Alverston. And here we have a similar coat of arms. This is said to be the coat of arms of his Reputed son, Ralph Benson, born 1773, of Lutwich Hall in Shropshire. Here we have a picture of Lutwich Hall. And if you enjoyed this video and would like to find out who your ancestors were, more about them, and whether or not they owned a coat of arms, please visit us at coadb.com where we offer professional genealogy research services. Link in the description. Thank you very much.